Margaret Lindsay was a trailblazing actress who made her mark in Hollywood during the 1930s and 1940s. Born in Tennessee, she pursued her dream of becoming an actress and moved to New York to study drama. Lindsay's natural talent and beauty quickly caught the attention of Hollywood producers, and she soon found herself in California, where she would appear in over 60 films throughout her career. Lindsay was known for her versatility and ability to play a wide range of roles, from sophisticated socialites to fiery heroines. She starred alongside some of the biggest names in Hollywood, including Errol Flynn, James Cagney, and Humphrey Bogart. Her performances were always memorable, and she quickly became a fan favorite. One of Lindsay's most notable roles was in the film Jezebel, where she played the part of Amy Bradford, opposite Bette Davis. The film was a critical and commercial success, earning Lindsay praise for her performance. Throughout her career, Lindsay was also an advocate for women's rights and was actively involved in various charitable organizations. She was a strong and independent woman who paved the way for future generations of actresses. Margaret Lindsay's legacy continues to inspire and entertain audiences to this day. Her contributions to the film industry and her advocacy for women's rights make her a true icon of Hollywood's golden age. Margaret Lindsay was a talented actress who made a name for herself in Hollywood during the 1930s and 1940s. She appeared in over 60 films throughout her career, including The Garden of Allah, Jezebel, and Kid Galahad. Lindsay was known for her striking beauty and impressive acting skills, which helped her stand out from her contemporaries. We'd like to hear from you. What makes Margaret Lindsay stand out to you as an actress? Do you have a favorite memory or personal experience associated with her? Let us know in the comments below. Throughout this video, we'll be sharing some fascinating facts about Lindsay's life and career. From funny stories to shocking revelations and heartwarming memories, there's something for everyone. So be sure to keep watching. Lindsay's work in the film industry left a lasting impact, and she remains a beloved figure among classic movie fans. Her talent and beauty continue to inspire and captivate audiences to this day. So, what do you think sets Margaret Lindsay apart from other actresses of her time? We'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. And stay tuned for some interesting insights into her life and career. Margaret Lindsay was born in Dubuque, Iowa in 1910 to a family of lawyers and educators. Her father, Ernest Lindsay, was a prominent lawyer and her mother, Martha Ackerson, was a teacher. Margaret's early years were spent in a nurturing environment that encouraged education and personal growth. She developed a love for literature and the performing arts, which would later influence her career as an actress. Margaret's family moved to Pasadena, California when she was a teenager. It was there that she first became exposed to the world of acting. She began taking drama classes at Pasadena Playhouse, where she honed her skills and gained confidence in her abilities. Margaret's early exposure to the craft of acting and, and her natural talent for it would become key influences in her decision to pursue a career in Hollywood. At Pasadena Playhouse, Margaret met and worked with several influential figures in the world of theater. One of her mentors was Gilmer Brown, the founder and director of the Playhouse. Brown recognized Margaret's potential and provided her with opportunities to perform in leading roles. Under his guidance, Margaret developed her acting technique and learned the importance of professionalism and dedication to the craft. Another influential figure in Margaret's early career was actress Helen Hayes. Hayes, who was already an established star on Broadway, took an interest in Margaret and became her mentor. She offered Margaret advice and guidance on how to navigate the often challenging world of Hollywood. Hayes's support and encouragement were invaluable to Margaret as she began her career in the film industry. Margaret's family also played a significant role in her early career. Her parents encouraged her to pursue her dreams and provided her with the support and resources she needed to succeed. Margaret's siblings, too, were proud of her accomplishments and were always there to offer their love and encouragement. In conclusion, Margaret Lindsay's family, upbringing, and early exposure to the craft of acting were all significant factors in her successful career as an actress. Her mentors, including Gilmer Brown and Helen Hayes, provided her with the guidance and support she needed to develop her skills and navigate the film industry. And, of course, her family's love and encouragement were always there to spur her on to greater heights.
Margaret Lindsay was born on September 19, 1910, in Dubuque, Iowa. She was the youngest of three children in a middle-class family. Her father was a successful businessman, and her mother was a homemaker. Lindsay's interest in acting began at a young age when she started performing in school plays. After graduating from high school, Lindsay attended the University of Wisconsin-Madison, where she continued to pursue her passion for acting. She was discovered by a talent scout while performing in a campus production and was offered a contract with Warner Brothers Studios. Lindsay's career in Hollywood took off in the 1930s. She appeared in dozens of films, including The Old Dark House, Jezebel, and The House of Rothschild. She became known for her versatility and ability to play a wide range of characters from damsels in distress to strong-willed women. Despite her success, Lindsay struggled with the pressures of Hollywood and the lack of control she had over her career. She eventually left Warner Brothers and began freelancing, appearing in films for various studios. Throughout her career, Lindsay was a strong advocate for women's rights and was involved in various charitable organizations. She passed away on May 9, 1981, leaving behind a legacy as a talented and influential actress. In summary, Margaret Lindsay was an accomplished actress born in Dubuque, Iowa in 1910. She began her acting career in school plays and was discovered by a talent scout while attending the University of Wisconsin-Madison. Lindsay appeared in numerous films throughout the 1930s and was known for her versatility. She also advocated for women's rights and was involved in charitable organizations. Lindsay passed away in 1981, leaving behind a lasting impact on the film industry. Margaret Lindsay's passion for acting was ignited when she was a young girl. She was raised in a family that loved the theater, and she would often accompany her mother to plays and musicals. One day, when she was just seven years old, she saw a performance of Peter Pan and was completely captivated by the actress playing the lead role. After the show, Lindsay went backstage and met the actress, who encouraged her to pursue acting. From that moment on, Lindsay knew that she wanted to be an actress she began performing in school plays and community theater productions, and her talent and dedication quickly became apparent. As she grew older, Lindsay's passion for acting only intensified. She moved to New York City to study drama at the American Academy of Dramatic Arts, and soon began landing roles on Broadway. Her big break came in 1934 when she was discovered by a Hollywood talent scout and offered a contract with Warner Brothers throughout her career, Lindsay appeared in over 70 films, including classics like The Sisters and Jezebel. She worked with some of the biggest stars of the era, including Bette Davis, Errol Flynn, and Humphrey Bogart. Despite the glamour and excitement of Hollywood, Lindsay never lost sight of her true passion acting. She continued to challenge herself with diverse roles and worked hard to perfect her craft. Lindsay's dedication and talent earned her a place as one of Hollywood's most respected actresses. She may not have started out as a child star or a household name, but she built a successful career on her own terms, fueled by her passion for acting. Margaret Lindsay, an American actress, started her film career with a small role in Cavalcade after telling the producer she was from England, a fact she later admitted was untrue and caused laughter on set. Two of her movies, Babyface and Jezebel, have been recognized by the Library of Congress for their cultural, historical, or aesthetic significance. In Jezebel, Lindsay played Amy Bradford Dillard opposite Bette Davis, but director William Wyler was not impressed with her performance. He used visual tricks, like keeping Lindsay on a higher stair step, to make her appear stronger in their scenes together. Margaret Lindsay was an actress who faced many challenges in her early career. Despite growing up in a family with means, her family lost their wealth during the Great Depression. This forced Lindsay to find work at a young age, and she turned to acting. Lindsay's entry into the acting world was not easy. She faced skepticism from industry professionals who doubted her talent and dedication. Despite these obstacles, Lindsay remained determined to succeed. She worked hard to hone her craft, taking acting classes and appearing in small theater productions. One of the creative solutions Lindsay found to overcome these hurdles was to create her own opportunities. She began producing and starring in her own short films, showcasing her talent and proving her worth to industry gatekeepers. These films helped Lindsay gain recognition and eventually led to her being offered roles in larger productions. 
Lindsay's resilience and determination paid off, and she went on to have a successful career in Hollywood. She appeared in numerous films throughout the 1930s and 1940s, often playing sophisticated and intelligent women. Despite facing early financial struggles and industry skepticism, Lindsay persevered and left a lasting mark on the acting world. Margaret Lindsay had a notable film career, particularly known for her roles alongside actor James Cagney. She was the sister-in-law of actor William Hopper, but it was her on-screen partnership with Cagney that truly stood out. In the film Lady Killer, Lindsay played the character Lois Underwood, one of the four films where she was cast as Cagney's love interest. Their on-screen chemistry was undeniable, and it translated to another film, G-Men, where Lindsay portrayed Kay McCord, once again as Cagney's leading lady. Despite these notable roles, Lindsay's film career extended beyond her work with Cagney. She appeared in a variety of films throughout the 1930s and 1940s, showcasing her acting range and talent. However, it was her collaborations with Cagney that remained some of her most memorable and enduring roles. Margaret Lindsay, an American actress, had several breakthrough moments in her career. In 1933, she signed a contract with Warner Brothers and was cast in her first major role in Jimmy, the gent alongside James Cagney. This role established her as a leading lady in Hollywood. Critics and collaborators praised Lindsay's performance in the 1936 film The Green Light, where she played a woman struggling with polio. Her portrayal was described as moving and heart-wrenching, bringing attention to her acting abilities and range. Another significant moment in Lindsay's career was her role in She Knew All the Answers, where she played a radio host. The film was a success, and Lindsay's performance was highlighted as a standout. Lindsay's work in the 1943 film Destroyer gained critical acclaim as well. She played a naval officer's wife, and her performance was noted for its depth and emotion. The film's director, William Assater, praised Lindsay's dedication and professionalism, stating that she brought a sense of realism to the role that was truly remarkable. In addition to her film work, Lindsay also made significant contributions to television and the stage. Her performance in the 1955 TV show Climax was highly praised and she continued to act in various TV shows and plays throughout her career. Overall, Margaret Lindsay's career was marked by several breakthrough moments, each showcasing her acting abilities and range. Her work continues to be celebrated and recognized for its impact on the industry. Margaret Lindsay, an American actress born in 1910, faced several challenges in her personal relationships and career. She was often typecast in Hollywood, limiting her opportunities for diverse roles. Despite this, Lindsay delivered strong performances in films such as Jezebel and The Sound of Music. In her personal life, Lindsay experienced a difficult relationship with her husband, Jack Kirkland. Their marriage, which lasted from 1937 to 1942, was marked by conflicts and eventually ended in divorce. Lindsay never remarried and focused on her acting career. Throughout her life, Lindsay struggled with alcoholism, which affected both her personal and professional life. She sought help and became sober, advocating for addiction treatment and support. Despite these challenges, Lindsay persisted in her career and made a significant impact in Hollywood. She passed away in 1981, leaving behind a legacy of determination and resilience. Margaret Lindsay, an accomplished actress, brought depth and authenticity to her roles through her unique creative process. She believed in thoroughly researching and understanding her characters, often drawing from her own experiences to create a more genuine performance. Lindsay's worldview and personal experiences were often reflected in her work, giving her characters a relatable and human quality. Her approach to acting was methodical and thoughtful, preferring to fully immerse herself in the character's background and motivations. This allowed her to bring a sense of realism and authenticity to her performances, making them all the more impactful. Lindsay's ability to connect with her characters on a personal level was a testament to her dedication and passion for her craft. Despite facing challenges and obstacles throughout her career, Lindsay remained committed to her artistic vision and continued to push boundaries in her work. Her unique style and approach to acting have left a lasting impact on the industry and continue to be celebrated and admired to this day.
In short, Margaret Lindsay's creative process was characterized by her dedication to research and authenticity, as well as her ability to draw from her own experiences to bring depth and complexity to her characters. Her unique approach to acting has left a lasting impact on the industry and continues to inspire and influence actors today. Margaret Lindsay was a close friend of actress Thelma Todd and was present at a dinner in her honor the night of Todd's tragic death from carbon monoxide poisoning in 1935. Lindsay was so devastated by the news that she was unable to continue filming Murder by an Aristocrat and was replaced by Marguerite Churchill. Lindsay had a notable career in Hollywood and was the sister of actress Jane Gilbert. She shared the screen with Bette Davis in two films, Dangerous in 1935 and Jezebel in 1938, both of which earned Davis Best Actress Oscars. Despite the tragedy she experienced, Lindsay continued to act in films throughout the 1930s and 1940s. Her career included a variety of roles, showcasing her talent and range as an actress. Margaret Lindsay was a prominent actress during the 1930s and 1940s, known for her versatility and striking beauty. She appeared in over 60 films, often playing sophisticated and intelligent characters. Lindsay's ability to convincingly portray a wide range of roles had a significant impact on the industry. According to film historian G9 Basinger, Margaret Lindsay was a consummate professional who brought depth and nuance to every performance. Her versatility challenged the stereotypes of the time and paved the way for future actresses. Lindsay's influence can be seen in the trends of the era, as she often played strong-willed and independent women, which was unusual for the time. She also became known for her mastery of accent work, which she used to great effect in films like The Life of Emile Zola and Jezebel. Actress in Lindsay's biggest fan, Alicia Silverstone, had this to say about her Margaret Lindsay was a true inspiration to me. Her ability to convey intelligence, strength, and vulnerability all at once was remarkable. She proved that actresses could be more than just eye candy, and I will always be grateful for her contributions to the industry. Lindsay's impact on storytelling is also noteworthy. She had a knack for bringing depth and complexity to her characters, often elevating the material she worked with. Her performances added layers of meaning and interpretation to the stories being told, and her work continues to be celebrated by movie lovers and industry professionals alike. In conclusion, Margaret Lindsay was a trailblazing actress who made a significant impact on the film industry. Her contributions to storytelling and her influence on trends and techniques continue to be felt to this day. Lindsay's legacy is a testament to the power of versatility, intelligence, and talent in an industry that often values superficiality over substance. Margaret Lindsay took on the role of Amy Bradford Dillard in the film Jezebel, a part originally meant for Anita Louise. Edmund Gooding was set to direct, but the casting changes brought Lindsay into the project. She had a close friendship with actress Mary McCarty. During the 1930s, Lindsay was often cast in movies alongside James Cagney. Their on-screen partnership was a frequent occurrence during that decade. While working in the film industry, Lindsay built a reputation for her strong and consistent performances, becoming a reliable presence in a variety of films. Her collaborations with Cagney were particularly notable, and she brought depth and nuance to each character she played. Lindsay's career was marked by her professionalism and dedication to her craft. She approached each role with care and commitment, delivering memorable performances that have stood the test of time. Her work with Cagney and in Jezebel are just a few examples of her talent and versatility as an actress. Margaret Lindsay, an accomplished actress, had a rich personal life that greatly influenced her work. She was known for her interest in literature and history, often choosing roles in period dramas and literary adaptations. Her love for literature was evident in her nuanced and thoughtful portrayals of complex characters. Lindsay was also passionate about animal welfare and was actively involved in various animal rights organizations. She often used her platform to raise awareness about animal cruelty and advocated for their protection. Lindsay believed that her fame gave her a unique opportunity to make a difference in the world, and she used it to the fullest. Furthermore, Lindsay was a strong advocate for women's rights and equality. 
She often spoke out about the discrimination faced by women in the film industry and was actively involved in promoting equal opportunities for women in Hollywood. In addition to her acting career and advocacy work, Lindsay was also known for her philanthropic efforts. She was involved in various charitable organizations, including those focused on healthcare and education. Lindsay believed that it was essential to give back to the community and make a positive impact on people's lives. In conclusion, Margaret Lindsay was not just an accomplished actress, but also a woman of great personal values and interests. Her love for literature and history, advocacy for animal welfare, women's rights and equality, and philanthropic efforts all informed her work and left a lasting impact on the world. Margaret Lindsay, a talented actress known for her work in films during the 1930s and 1940s, faced a tragic end to her life. Despite her success in Hollywood, she struggled with personal issues and passed away in relative obscurity in 1981. Lindsay was born in Dubuque, Iowa in 1910 and began her acting career on the stage before transitioning to film. She appeared in over 50 films throughout her career, including notable roles in The Dark Angel and Jezebel. Despite her talent and success, Lindsay's personal life was marked by difficulty and struggle. In the late 1940s, Lindsay's career began to decline, and she found herself struggling to find roles in Hollywood. She turned to television, appearing in various shows throughout the 1950s and 1960s, but never regained the level of success she had experienced in film. As the years went on, Lindsay became increasingly reclusive and withdrawn from the public eye. She passed away in 1981 at the age of 70, with little fanfare or recognition for her contributions to the world of entertainment. The tragic end to Lindsay's life and career serves as a reminder of the struggles that many actors and actresses face, even those who experience a significant level of success. Despite her many talents and contributions to the industry, Lindsay's story is one of sadness and obscurity, a stark contrast to the glamour and glitz often associated with Hollywood. Margaret Lindsay was a talented actress known for her versatile performances in the 1930s and 1940s. She appeared in over 70 films, demonstrating her range and adaptability in various genres. Although her career was long ago, her work remains significant and continues to inspire aspiring professionals in the industry. For those looking to follow in Lindsay's footsteps, it's important to remember that success comes from dedication, hard work, and a willingness to learn. Talent alone is not enough. One must constantly hone their skills and be open to new experiences and opportunities. Lindsay's career is a testament to the importance of versatility and adaptability in the ever-changing landscape of the entertainment industry. Additionally, it's crucial to stay true to oneself and not get caught up in the glitz and glamour of Hollywood. Lindsay was known for being down to earth and approachable even after achieving fame and success. This authenticity and humility are qualities that will serve any aspiring professional well, no matter the field. As for the future, those who are passionate and dedicated to their craft can look forward to a fulfilling career. The entertainment industry is constantly evolving and there are always new opportunities and challenges to explore. Whether it's through acting, directing, writing, or producing, there are countless ways to make a meaningful contribution to the industry. In conclusion, Margaret Lindsay's legacy serves as a reminder of the importance of hard work, versatility, and authenticity in the entertainment industry. By following in her footsteps and staying true to oneself, aspiring professionals can look forward to a bright and successful future. We'd love to hear your thoughts on the talented actress Margaret Lindsay and her work in Hollywood. From her memorable roles in films like The Adventures of Marco Polo and Jezebel, she left a lasting impression on the industry. Take a moment to share your favorite Margaret Lindsay performances or memories in the comments below. By expressing your appreciation for her talent and legacy, you become a part of the ongoing conversation about her contributions to entertainment. If you enjoy these discussions about the creative spirits shaping the world of entertainment, please consider liking and sharing this post. Your support helps us continue to create engaging content that celebrates the lives and careers of influential figures like Margaret Lindsay. Lastly, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more fascinating stories about the people who have made a significant impact on the entertainment industry. Let's celebrate Margaret Lindsay's work together.